What's up? You are looking snatched today. Nothing much. Come on, tell me. Andrew and I have a date tonight. It has been a long time since we've eaten out, so... I heard that you guys are going to have a long holiday together. Oh my god, Andrew must tell everything to Jackson. We're going to travel to Asia for two weeks. Awesome. When do you leave? I'm not sure. Andrew is still checking flight tickets. You are very happy. I'm sure that Andrew loves you so much. I'm so jealous. Come on. Jackson also loves you much. Marriage is not the same as love. What's up? Your marriage is so happy, isn't it? Recently, I have had some bad thoughts. Tell me. I really don't want to chit-chat about my husband. But, you know, it's a bit stressful. I've never gotten married, but maybe I can help. Yesterday, by chance, I saw a message on Jackson's phone. And it is too out there. Who was it? I don't know. It's from a creep. What does it say? Dude, you forgot a gift box at my house. This one has a card written, It was a gift from your sweetheart. Do you want to come by my house to collect it, or should I bring it home for you? By the way, don't forget we have an important party tomorrow. The last dangerous person is your wife. Keep this secret from your wife. Call me back when you have time. See ya. Peace. Oh my god. Do you think the same is what I'm thinking? Yeah, that's how it goes. Did you ask Jackson directly? Yeah, absolutely. I asked if he had any important meeting tomorrow, but he said no. But I don't believe him this time. He was so nervous when I asked him. Lame. You should have asked him until he gave you a reasonable answer. I did. But he tried to ignore communicating with me at that time. That's weird. It's not what Jackson usually does. I think he has another woman. Or am I overthinking? I think maybe he is misunderstood. You should ask him clearly before deciding anything. I'm not in the mood for it. I think I should follow him today. Then I'm going to catch him red-handed. Same here. I'm in. Cool. His assistant told me he has a meeting in one hour. Please follow those wheels. Thank you. I get it. Where's he going? A jewelry store. Oh my god. Should we come closer? No way. That is sketchy. Dude, get down. Sorry. <gasps> down if you want to see who he's going to meet. Okay. He must have an affair with someone. 100%. Why does he need to buy jewelry, flowers, and cake? Isn't he arranging a romantic date with a chick? Why not me? I'm his wife. Oh my god. Calm down. Nothing is for sure. Why not? Take a deep breath. Linda, he stopped at a restaurant. Let me see. What's he doing? He's just standing there. Maybe he's waiting for someone. 
he is cheating on me, I'm going to kill him. Oh, Andrew's calling. Hi, Bay. Honey, why do you say that in a whisper? Ah, I'm in a library. What's up, Bay? Nothing. I just miss you. I miss you, too. Don't forget we have a date today. Oh, yeah, I remember. I will come on time. See you, Bay. Love you. Love you. Bye. Oh, my. I almost forgot our date today. You should leave now. If not, you might be late. Yeah, let me check on how far it is. Oh, what a coincidence. Our restaurant is the one that Jackson went to. Really? Yeah, I will come to see what is happening, then I will call you. Okay, I will wait for you here. Hi, Jackson. Is this your gift box? Yeah, it belongs to my wife. I forgot it at Andrew's house. Thank God he found out and brought it here for me. Oh my, Jackson. You're so sweet. Why didn't Victoria pick up my phone? What is happening out there? I can't wait here anymore. I should come in. I need to see everything in person. <gasps> Jackson, I didn't think you're that kind of man. I'm so disappointed. Linda! You're here. Oh, my. I knew it. Now everything is clear. You don't need to explain anything. Excuse me, everyone. Look at my husband. He received a pinky gift from his lover. How romantic. Enjoy your lovely date with your love. Your wife will leave right now. <gasps> Look what you've done to your dear wife who loves you so much. Linda, don't shout. Are you always like this? You know, though you have some bad habits, I forgive all of them. You know how much I love you, right? You did this because you love me? Linda, calm down. It is not what you are thinking. Listen to me. Victoria, what is happening? Look! Oh my god. Is it? Yeah, Andrew just proposed to me. And she said, yes, we're getting hitched. So everything is... Yeah, Jackson just helped me to buy something for this proposal party. Congrats. Why didn't you tell me, Jackson? You're Victoria's bestie. I was afraid the plan would be revealed, so I told Jackson to not tell you. I'm so sorry. But you didn't even invite me. Check your phone, Linda. I called you a thousand times. Oh, my. My bad. I didn't even have the mind to keep an eye on my phone. Luckily, you're still here by chat. I was going to call you to come, but my phone ran out of battery. However, Jackson, what about the message from a stranger about the gift box? That's Andrew's number. He changed his phone, remember? I haven't saved it yet. What is that gift box for? Who is she? Is everyone covering for them? She's my sister. I had no time to give the gift box back to Jackson, so she just helped me. Really? Yeah, I have a husband and two children. They're over there. Oh, my. I'm so embarrassed. I'm so sorry, Jackson. That's fine, but you know, you need to trust me. I love you, and I will never cheat on you. I get it. I also love you. I know I have many bad habits. I will try to get rid of them. This gift is for you. Thank you so much. 
Would you like to travel to Asia? Oh my. Really? That is so sick. Yeah, Andrew and I are booking tickets for us. We can travel together this time. You are so sweet, Jackson. I'm hungry. Let's have dinner together. Have a blast. 